Hi, this is Whalen. Much has been written in the press about how major U.S. tech companies like Google are able to pay very little tax on their on their profits from non-U.S. operations. Like, for example, uh, Google has been reported uh, to be paying as little as five percent uh, on their net uh, net profit from uh, their operations outside of the U.S. A, a specific international tax planning strategy that companies uh, like Google and, and others have been reported uh, to use is something called uh, the uh, Double Irish uh, Dutch Sandwich. So we'll, we'll, we'll go through the mechanics of what that uh, Double Irish Dutch Sandwich uh, involves, where the Irish comes from and where the, where the Dutch uh, comes from. So we start with the U.S. Uh, parent corporation, a company like Google or other major uh, tech tech companies. So that that U.S. Uh, parent corporation, you know, pays pays U.S. Uh, income tax. The the U.S. parent corp forms a subsidiary uh, in Ireland, so it's incorporated in Ireland, but the but the uh, corporation is resident for tax purposes in Bermuda by having the management and control uh, resident in, in Bermuda. So we call that the Irish Bermudian uh, Hold Co. And that Irish Bermudian Hold Co. forms a Dutch holding company. So that's, that's in the Netherlands. So that's a holding company. And also the Irish Bermudian Hold Co. forms an operating company in Ireland. So the first step using this structure is that the U.S. parent licenses uh, some piece of intellectual property. It could be, let's say, the rights to use uh, the software for a search engine or other, or other technology. So that's licensed uh, uh, to uh, the Irish Bermudian Holco, and there, and there will be an agreed uh, royalty rate that will be paid uh, to the U.S. parent uh, corporation uh, by the Irish uh, Bermudian Holco. The second step is that you know, that, uh, that that IP license is then sublicensed down down to the Dutch Holdco, and then the Dutch Holdco sublicenses sublicenses again to the Irish Opco, and the Irish Opco uses that that intellectual property to earn uh, business revenue uh, from various operations uh, which are based uh, outside outside the U.S. So it could be uh, Europe or the Middle East, or Africa, or anywhere else. So the Irish Opco earns, earns that business uh, revenue. And, th and that Irish Opco, because of uh, Irish law, pays little or no Irish tax, uh, because they're able, they have to claim that revenue as, as income in Ireland, but they're also able to claim a deduction of the royalties that it will pay for the sub-license to the Dutch to the Dutch Holco, and under Irish tax law, there's no there's no withholding tax on that payment of royalty from the Irish Opco to the Dutch Holco. So there's no there's no tax uh, involved there. And that Dutch Holco uh, does pay Dutch tax on on their net income, which would include the royalties. But that that those royalties. Uh, that royalty income is offset by uh, deductions for royalties that the Dutch Holco pays to the Irish Bermudian Holco, and that and that payment from the Dutch Holco to the Irish Bermudian Holco is is not subject to any withholding tax because under Dutch law, it's, uh, withholding tax does not does not apply. The next step then is that uh, with that money, or at least with with a part of that money. The Irish Bermudian Holco pays royalties uh, to the U.S. Parent Corp as per their their li original license agreement. So the U.S. Parent Corp would pay U.S. tax on on the net income from those from those royalties. But the net effect of this whole structure is that most of the income from this non from the non-U.S. operations uh, ends up in in this Irish Bermudian Holco. Uh, which, because it's tax resident in Bermuda, is not subject to any to any corporate tax. So that so that money uh, in that Irish Bermudian Hold Co. is reinvested in uh, the non-U.S. operations uh, of of this multinational uh, corporation. So the money 
uh, is not brought back uh, to to the U.S. It stays outside the U.S. and is reinvested in in the non-U.S. operations. I hope you found that interesting.